So we're sitting at the picnic table instead. Yeah, we've got our <laughs> camp chairs and everything with us, but let's figure here we could uh, just enjoy. That's the swamp. <laughs> what you doing in my swamp? <laughs> what are you doing in my swamp? You're a pretty looking trick though. <laughs> Good green. So what we got, so we did get some hot cross buns, which is some sweet stuff that people eat here at Easter. And some egg and bacon rolls. Egg and bacon. Cheese Scratch and that. bacon. <laughs> Cheese and bacon rolls. Um, from Baker's Delight. Uh, it's a, a baker chain here in Australia. Uh, Sorry, I'm hungry. <laughs> she is hungry. She's hangry actually is what she is. We saw another track really nice and interesting. So, oh, we should drive it. No, I don't feel like it. Mm, you're really hungry, aren't you? Yes. <laughs> okay. So, here we are, everybody. One day we should go up to the Pilliga. Yeah. He'll wait till diesel prices go down again. <laughs> Fuck no. That's one thing that's crazy, everybody, is at the moment, uh, with everything going on in the world, um, i.e. Russia and Ukraine, um, fuel prices here in Australia are going through the roof, as I believe they are in Europe, uh, and probably throughout the rest of the world too, but um, in two weeks, it's gone from $1.80 a litre, and actually I'll rephrase that, when we got here, uh, back in Australia, which was uh, the end of December, uh, early January, we paid a dollar sixty a litre. Today is the basically middle of March, early March to middle of March, and it's two dollars thirty a litre. And they're saying here that we're going to see it hit uh, over three dollars a litre uh, by the end of the month. And, um, you know, our, our truck's a thirsty girl. <laughs> you know, we, we carry 170 litres of diesel on board. Um, and we, we see a thousand kilometres out of that. And I know that might sound absolutely insane to a number of you who drive things like, you know, a little Mazda 1 or, you know, a little uh, commuter car. And our, our truck is a commuter but it commutes us to places like this. And it takes us around and we get to travel and not have to worry about what's around the corner. We can just drive there. And that, that's the whole point of our rig. Um, and to take you guys with us too, I guess. So, but unfortunately, yeah. if the fuel prices continue to go up, it's gonna limit us uh, in the future. In and terms of where we're gonna go for videos. Yeah. Um, with how with how far afield we can go um, but the prices will come back down again and uh, the further afield we shall travel <laughs> exactly but for now I'm also done eating so let's hit the road again Jack Let, let's hit the road again I need to pour some water over my hands because they're absolutely full of chocolate and everything else <laughs> I just use my jeans I tried it the, wouldn't come off the beauty is my wifey does the washing so <laughs> I just scrubbed it into the jeans nice and tight. <laughs> so, it didn't work. <laughs> but anyway guys, we're going to uh, go and explore some more. The day is still young as they say, kind of. I'm already tired, that's because my Red Bull wore off. <laughs> well, she's got no choice but to sit in that passenger seat and film. So uh, <laughs> we will uh, go and find another track I think. Maybe. The, the look I'm getting right now is saying that we're probably not, but I, I'm not done yet for the day. I want to keep looking around. So, uh, well, we're going to discuss that and we will see you later in any case. Last note is, I'm driving, so I'll just keep turning where I'm turning. Hey, you can only get cranky. What are you going to do? Walk home? There's plenty of things I can do, trust me. That is a good point, everybody. I, I should be uh, scared. I really should. <laughs> All right. We'll see you a little bit later. All right, catch you. Hi guys, editing birdie here again. 
This is the route we ended up going this afternoon. We started off by going down the Barrington Top Central Trail, and oh boy were we in for a few surprises. We then stopped at the Manning River before heading our way back down the mountain. I was zoomed in. Come on, <laughs> right, so we have decided our next trail is the Barrington Trail Central. In other words, I won everybody, we're doing another trial. <laughs> he did win. I did give him this win. We've got to, you know, share the wins. So this is a, a fire trail. It says it's not suitable for normal vehicles. So and we're going to go. It says closed to all vehicles past this point if wet or snowing. Yep, but the trail is open, so it should be fine. But this is the first one that said not suitable for all vehicles yeah. that we've been on, so we may need hubs here. We'll we see. <laughs> yep, we'll need hubs. Let's start the light. Horses, horses, stop. Stop, stop. Guys, there's a horse. There's more behind. We can't see it very well, guys. Just keep driving slowly. We can't get better footage of them from here. Ozzy has to get it out to lock in the hubs. So I can get attacked by all of Unlike it. Guys, all is good. Even though I missed the stallion earlier, we saw multiple horses. That's amazing. That is. I'm that glad is, we decided so to do pretty. this road or track. The reason we actually stopped was that we need to lock the hubs in because we're about to go through some mud. So you'll see what this truck is meant for. Well, we don't know that it's very deep at all, but well, I, we don't I'm know. doing it anyway just because the track does specifically say not for all vehicles, and it's the first trail that we're doing up here that says that. Yeah. So. Oh. We'll see how we go. Exactly. <laughs> oh, I am going to try and hold the camera steady, but we'll see how that goes. That was so beautiful. <laughs> uh, it's nothing. That 
That really wasn't very bad. It was a bit of water really, but it had a solid bottom. Well, just deep. Yeah, exactly. It had a solid bottom. Oh, there's another one. I wouldn't have seen that one because I'm turned too late, but... Really, it's nothing. We're driving a two-wheel drive, everybody. <laughs> yep. <laughs> saying not for every vehicle, it must just mean it's not for people's little two-wheel drive city cars. Exactly. Um, but yeah, if it gets a bit shaky, that's because the trail is a bit rough. Uh, and I'm trying my best to hold it steady, but can't promise, guys. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Get a fact. <laughs> It's actually fed by a creek, a yeah. spring. Saw that. It's a lot of running water. Now we know why they say it's not suitable after wet weather. <laughs> Some deep holes. I think you may be correct if we're coming back up, but we might be full drive. Yeah. I think we're about halfway. We've just gotten to the bottom of the gully where there's a little creek running through it. So I'm I had assuming to, we're I had up. to turn the camera off because I couldn't. I banked my head trying to video and go through those mud holes at the same time. And uh, I wish we had the top camera on because uh, at some stage I was seriously concerned we were going to. Yeah, she thought we were going on our side. And uh, to be honest, this is one of those tracks that we said we probably weren't going to do today because we didn't have anyone with us. Yeah. Mm. That is this track, to be completely honest. Um, but but we just got to a beautiful creek, so I'm gonna show you that. <laughs> the big the big girl's doing good. The truck's doing everything she's supposed to. I got a bit muddy. I don't know whether you can see that in the camera, but I uh, didn't put the window up because it didn't look really that dangerous or scary. And it I was. got covered in mud. It was. She thought we were going on our side, but the the big GU just powered down and she did it. Yeah, but. There's not much in it. <laughs> There's not much in it. <laughs> because this fucker, he went past high four. He put it in two so, wheel drive. Okay, so I was in low range, expecting to have to go into this massive deep crossing. Realized as a side track that it was really soft mud. So I clicked it up to high four, but I went all the way past high four and went to two wheel drive. Yeah. So we did it in two wheel drive, but I didn't realize. And uh, uh, mind you, that track looked like it was a bit too sh uh, too narrow for this truck, and we were going to slide into the hole. I mean, we were a little bit, but we, we got it. Woo! I have faith in the truck. Anyway, let's go and get a video of this creek and get the hell out of here. Oh yeah, I fucking agree. <laughs> The interesting thing is, guys, you see that creek, right? You can also see all the flat grass everywhere around it, where you can see that there's been water recently. And if we go to the other side... Let me see. Camera frame. Right. That's the water now. We can also see where all the uh, uh, grass has been pushed over, where we recently had loads and loads and loads of water. And the crazy so, thing is, we're at the top of the hill. Like, we are, we're, like we're at the top of the start of the range. Yeah. So the amount of water that's coming through here, 
is nothing compared to what's coming out a kilometre or two down. Exactly. But we're going to get back in the truck. It looks like we're actually going uphill now, so fingers crossed. But the other side was the muddy wet side, and this is just going to be the rocky, easy climb. Because if we have to go back up the way we came... This video just became all about some crazy four-wheel drive video. And it won't be much fun. <laughs> no, I think the wifey may have a heart attack, but we'll see. Probably. So maybe, maybe next time you'll see me, I'm still alive. Who knows? <laughs> Otherwise, he'll just, you know, take a photo of me in the seat. <laughs> Guys, we found a crossroads. We actually see a road close sign ahead. No, oh, that, no that gate is open. That gate is open. That, that, that's a crossroad. That means maybe we're out of this track. Maybe. <laughs> I, I survived it. <laughs> My poor little bubba's just a wee bit nervous about all this. Oh yeah, just a boo, teeny tiny little bit. Well, actually, this Maybe. is a, this is actually a proper main road now. Main road, woohoo! Let's go. Shall we go straight ahead and keep doing the same track? Nope. Oh yeah, look, right close to the left. So we have literally just come out on the other side. Ah, oh, that would be cool. That's exactly what. That we is the done. exact same road. We literally just went either side. Jump out, jump. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> right. That's the track we came out of. That is the other side of the road closed. Of two brand. <laughs> Still can't. Still can't. Let me try. Two Brabuka Road. I think so. That one. Due to bridge failures. Unsafe to all traffic. Also, do you love that the actual road closed sign is, is actually broken? And they've just used a stone. <laughs> anyway. She did good. I'll tell you what. She fucking smells ran elf rank water. <laughs> yeah, some of that mud I don't think has been driven through for a long time. Yeah. But anyway. Let's head that way. Yeah. Well, I, I mean, we can continue down that same muddy trail if you want. Um, I would prefer not to. Let's do that with two people. I kind of agree with you. I have to admit. <laughs> uh, yeah, so we're going to go back and yeah. All right, guys, we have made it to the river. Yes. We I'm did alive. make a little stop off. Wifey is alive after our uh, exploration, shall we say. Uh, but uh, we just wanted to quickly sting, stop by because we were actually coming up past this place, which we actually what thought we would. So, show you guys this, and we're going to get back in the truck. Little bridge, which is quite pretty. It is very pretty. Let's see if the horizon is aligned. Kinda. Kinda. Well. Well, guys. We are ending on a high note. Yep. Pardon the pun, but we are on our way out from the Barrington Tops. Um, we're just gonna drive yep. down the mountain. And head home from there and hope you enjoyed today. I know we did, even if we... Uh... Got a bit scary, but we certainly did enjoy it today. <laughs> did it was a fantastic day out. Got to explore the Barringtons. Actually ran into an old friend who we haven't seen for years while we're up here of all the strange places to run into somebody. Yeah. <laughs> um, all in all, fantastic day. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you haven't already, please hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. It really, really helps us grow. Comment on for one, what you like most for two, what else you'd like to see. Yep, and uh, we'll probably see you around on our uh, Twitch channel at some point. And um, if not, I just hope you enjoy this content. Bye, hey, guys. everybody. <laughs>